Alright guys, this is just a quick video tutorial on how I did the special effects in my Call of Duty cheesiest rap video ever. First off, you want to have Sony Vegas or any other video editor account of Spy Plane. First of all, let's take a video footage of my window. Just like that. Then I drew a picture of a counter spy plane, keyed it out, and then brought it over here to the video program. So as you can see, there is a picture of an airplane right there. Take the airplane and size it up right here. What this allows you to do is resize the airplane. When you stretch it out more, it'll make the airplane smaller, and you can use this to move around the airplane as well. So, so it fits right there inside my window frame, just like that. Next, on the timeline, go to the start of your video. So now you can see the airplane is there when it should be right up here in the sky like that just like that now the airplane is going to be at its smallest point since this is the farthest away and as you can see as the video goes on the airplane is still up there because I haven't added any motion to the airplane yet so we're going to rewind, rewind to right about here then we're going to fast forward this is the frame right before the airplane leaves screen so right here you want your airplane to be at its biggest point and also at its lowest point so you move the airplane down to the very bottom of the screen right there and then you also expand it a little bit and make it a little bit bigger just like this so as you can see we have a generally realistic looking airplane flying sorry you can go ahead and resize that so it doesn't look like it's flying in the window but over the window so yeah as you can see it looks pretty good up to this point and yeah now let's talk about explosions Go ahead and grab some explosion effects. You can get some free effects at detonationfilms.com. So what you do is grab an explosion, just like this one, put it onto the timeline, and as you can see, it plays with the black screen like this, and then it shows the explosion. Quick way to remove the black screen is to press this button right there with an A on it. Click here, and then click additive or add. As you can see, it removes the black screen, so all you're left with is a choppy looking video with explosion, just like that. And then just like before, you can go ahead and move the explosion or move whatever you need to do, wherever you feel like it. So if I want the airplane rising out of the explosion, you can do like this, and boom, you got a really beautiful airplane. You like that? Really, really, really nice. And then you can go ahead and do the same exact thing. So say when I want to add smoke for the video, all I did was grab a smoke effect. Like, oh, you know what? How about let's try something new? Let's add some rain. And you can go ahead and do this same technique for pretty much <clears throat> any video effect that has a black screen behind it. As long as the background is black, you set it to additive and you will instantly get some amazing looking footage like here. Obviously this isn't the best looking footage but still pretty good for noobs like you. And yeah, have fun, enjoy. I use Sony Vegas but so Sony Vegas, Adobe After Effects are two of my most favorite video editing software to use so yeah, thanks for watching. And what Click here to see last week's Call of Duty rap video. Don't forget to subscribe and get ready for the Call of Duty Black Ops rap video. Thanks for watching, I'm Stranger and what is one? Yeah. Call of Duty! I have a life.